How's it going guys and welcome to the Weeb Lounge. I am Nick and in this Blue Archive character spotlight we are taking a look at Hasumi. Yeah, it's a fallen angel with a sniper rifle with two really big mama milkers. Seems like it's like that with like half the characters in this, right? You got the, I, I should just refer to it as the double M and she's got justice written right across them and they are definitely justice. Okay, we'll leave it at that. Fallen Angel, probably not much on justice or whatever, but she's got a sniper rifle and she kind of looks deadly. Okay, I'm just gonna take my eyes over here and go over here. Let's get into the details. Character type, she is a striker unit. She will be on the field fighting for your rolling position. She's in the back line with the sniper rifle shooting you. Yeah, that's what she does. Environment, outdoors, she really likes, and the rest of the areas, she's kind of mad on. So, eh, whatever. Attack type and defense type are both yellow. And I always say yellow because, like, element or whatever. Yellow is explosive for her attack type, defense type, heavy armor, yellow. All right, normal skill, cold heart. You can kind of tell that by looking at her. It's just uh, what she does immediately reload when defeating an enemy. So she gets basically the last hit on an enemy. Putting She puts someone down, she will instantly reload and increase her critical damage by 30% for 13 seconds. So that's actually not bad at all. It's... As long as she gets that last hit, we're talking like League of Legends last hit kind of thing, you know, it's, it, you can't really control that much either. So it's, it's one of those things like maybe if you combine with her EX skill, which we'll get to, eh, we'll see. Passive skill, good aim. Increases critical damage by 14%. All right. Got mine up to 15.4. I put a little bit of effort into this character and early on she got like higher rated than what i thought she should be and then i guess i was right because she got downgraded i'll get into that a little bit more sub skill goal search i tried to retranslate this to see if it's something other than gold search because it doesn't really fit the rest of the whole the rest of the motto or whatever what it is when reloading normally increases her critical chance by 50 percent, but only for a single normal attack so Basically, these snipers tend to have a little bit longer of a reload timer. So she get reloads, she gets a 50% increase to uh, her next normal attack critical chance. Not normal skill, just a basic standard attack. So keep that in mind. EX skill. Armor piercing bullet has a cost of 5. It is a single target attack with damage equal to 574% of her attack power. Mine's up to 660%. I put a little effort into that. Actually, it's just like one level. That's a big difference for one level, yeah. But here's the thing, that cost compared to the attack damage that she does com when compared to other characters, eh, we'll get to it. Let's go ahead and throw her at a hard mode. I'm gonna start doing the hard modes instead of like these regular little things because I need shards and I have very, very limited this stuff. So let's go ahead and get in here. We're gonna do one, one. Very, very simple, very, very easy. She will not have a problem. All right, let's go ahead and get to this fourth one here. Kind of take her out. And she is level 51. Put her in there. Got those all good. Go ahead and do it to it. Now, this character, when I first started the game, you know, obviously I got this character right off the bat. And I was like, okay, this character seems like she could be pretty good, pretty deadly and everything. And early on, she was. Now, granted, you know, she does the yellow damage and the first five chapters are like red, so you didn't really get to use her all that much. But it was all right. All right, let's slow this down and... See, she basically has to reload almost every time she shoots. It's like, it's like a single shot, whatever. You know, I don't know if that's necessarily like a think 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 car ninety eight or whatever. You fire it, you have to or whatever. You know, pull the hammer, but something is just a little odd with that. Let's go ahead and do this, and you just select a target. It's just like a car ninety eight. A little bit of a delay, blaster in the head, does a lot of damage. It's all good. Okay, well that doesn't seem like the most impressive thing in the world, right? 
it's not. That's the, that's the thing. It's it's just not. It, well, you start here. She's hiding behind the van. Just shoot her in the head. There you go. Big old blast in the face. It'll do you good. Maybe her wings or her mama milker is getting in the way or something of her performance so well because just her constantly reloading is weird. But you think... If that's the case where she has to do that every single time, that's kind of considered a reload action. Does that translate over to the normal attacks and the reload little sub-skill dealy? I don't think it does. It, 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 it don't. It don't. If it did, we'd be seeing an awful lot more crits here, especially on 1-1 one, one hard mode. But anyways, you know, overall she is a decent sniper for yellow vulnerable mobs stages and stuff like that. But she is a lower ranked character for a whiz, uh, for a reason. The, the buff, she's a real slow character, so her buffs and everything that she's doing don't really stack all that well. In fact, they, it's kind of poor, to be honest. And her EX skill with a cost of 5, that's actually a really, really high cost considering the damage that she does. She's not really doing that much damage. Especially when you take other characters into effect. All right, we're charged up. We're going to blast that guy right in the face. There you go. He did. Now, that's the big problem with her. She just doesn't do the damage that you would expect her to do with all those skills. In the EX skill, there's other characters that outshine her quite a lot. And, you know, we're talking just about every sniper, really. At least the yellow damage type ones. And even some, like, special damage ones. Like Haruka, you can do some pretty decent damage. And it's just... I don't know, uh, Kanan does really, really good single target damage, and she's just a special mob, you know, she's not even on the field fighting for you. Hit the boss in the face, can you kill it one hit? Yes, you can, good job. We got an extra one there, throw it over here. I am. It works. But, I don't know, it, it, it's one of those characters like, you think of the Total War, right? She can, you can inject her into the Total War, She'll serve a purpose, she'll do fine, but she's not a top tier character in Total War. She's not going to perform better than a lot of other configurations. And you think PvP, the arena, no, you, you don't want her in there. She, she's going to just die worthless, whatever. You, it's not going to work. It's just not going to work. So overall, this character kind of gets a bit of a thumbs down. I mean, that is justice. That Justice always gets a thumbs up. We'll just leave it at that. But... Other than that, the only thing I can think of is to like, share, subscribe, and hit that notification button. Because, yeah, Justice is great and everything, but Justice on the battlefield? Eh, not so much, apparently. We'll see you in the next video.